There's a lot that goes on behind the counter in the pharmacy. First, we're building relationships with people in the community because we're helping manage their medication therapy. We are the most accessible healthcare professionals that anyone can see. So me being a pharmacy intern assists with all of those things that the pharmacist can do. My name is Travis Sumler. I'm a pharmacy intern at Rite Aid Pharmacy in Virginia Beach, Virginia, and I'm a graduate of the Pharmacy Technician Program from Norfolk Technical Center. I took the Pharmacy Technician class at Norfolk Technical Center. At the end, I was able to take my exam to be a certified pharmacy technician in the state of Virginia. So at the end of the class, I was able to obtain a licensure as a pharmacy technician, which allowed me to work in the pharmacy. The pharmacy technician program at Norfolk Technical Center prepared me to be licensed as a pharmacy technician and it gave me hands-on experience uh, with an externship we did at our local Walgreens to let me see exactly what it is that I was getting ready to walk into. After I completed a pharmacy technician course at Norfolk Technical Center and passed my state boards, I was a licensed pharmacy tech in the state of Virginia. I was 17, so I did not get a job in a pharmacy right away because most pharmacies don't hire uh, technicians until you're 18. It's not a law, really. It's just the way that a lot of pharmacies and companies operate. And I was also playing basketball in high school, so I didn't have a lot of time to work because I was very dedicated to my sports. So my senior year of high school, I was 18. As soon as the season ended, um, I started applying for jobs in the pharmacy. While I was in the pharmacy technician program, I was able to be a part of the student organization uh, called HOSA, which stands for Health Occupation Students of America. I was actually the president of our chapter, and that organization was composed of all of the medical and health-related classes in our building. Me being the president of the chapter, it gave me a chance to develop some leadership skills. I had to lead meetings. I had to come up with ideas. I had to organize things. I had to structure things. When I saw this, I'm like, man, this is a great opportunity for me to do something that can really make a difference. And I can be close enough to make a difference, but at the same time, I can be distant enough to be comfortable in what I'm doing and not have to be like really up close and personal, but still have that same type of personal life-changing relationship with someone.